football fan, legal advisor and pageant finalist are not words that you'd expect to pop up in the same sentence, unless you're describing Karusha Kylie Govinda. Kriya met up with Karusha to find out just how she comes to pack so much diversity into one dynamic package. If anyone can dispel the airhead pageant winner stereotype, it's Karusha Kylie Govender. And as current coordinator of the Miss Mamelodi Sundowns campaign, her goal is to create empowerment opportunities. She's also an early riser and suggests that I join her at the gym. Karusha, how are you? Good and you? Give me some love. Oh, good to see you. You too. Now, I thought hanging out with you for the day wasn't going to be this. Why are we a gym? No, we have to get in it. This is how I start my day. You're gonna join me. Okay, let's do this, let's do this. Okay, so we're gonna do a little calf stretch. I'm not even exercising yet and I'm already full. <laughs> All right, what's next? We're gonna do a quad stretch. Okay. Right leg, right arm. Okay, next leg. There we go. All right. Uh, this one I'm going to at least do because I'm sitting. It's comfortable. <laughs> Between your, your legal work, your Miss Sundowns work, you're really, really busy. And then you still find time for the gym. Gym is not about aesthetics for me. I really have to release endorphins, find me time, especially in a stressful work environment. It's a necessity. So you won Miss Sundowns in 2012 and you've really grown and done a lot of things since then. What has you know, your journey been like? It's been a whirlwind journey. I was just finishing my degree, my LLB, and I obviously had masters lined up for the next year, blew it off, <laughs> and it was the best decision of my life because I started working for Sundowns and it's been a whirlwind from there. My main role at Sundowns is a legal advisor. Okay. Close my mind every time <laughs> I think of it that I actually get to do this cool job yes. every day. Why did you decide to enter Miss Sundown? I am not a pageant person. You always find that girls that have entered have been doing it since they were little. And they train and they poise and they know exactly. this. And, yeah. and I am so far from that, <laughs> honestly, I am. What had happened was my sister had heard about the opportunity and she said, you know what, Karush, go for it. Well, you know what, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I'm in gym clothes. We might as well get some exercise in. Karush just set the pace and off we went. Whew. I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> Tell me that there's at least coffee before work. Yes, All of right, course. let's go. <laughs> Karusha took the Miss Mama Lodi Sundowns title in 2012 and went on to become a Miss South Africa finalist in 2015. Besides taking part in pageants, now you actually run Miss Sundown. It's been such a joy of mine. I always say I would do that job for free. Firstly, I've got to travel the length and breadth of this entire country, which is such a blessing, and meet women from all walks of life. You also work for AFI. I do. Um, AFI is one of our sister companies within the Montsepe Group. And of course, they put on Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week every year, which is always fun. Yes. As a woman, you love fashion, <laughs> love to get dressed up. Well, I'd love to sit here and sip coffees the whole day, but that's not normally what you do. What do we have on the cards for today? We are quickly going to Mamelodi Sundowns headquarters. Oh, yay. And then we are off to a workshop. Well, let's get going. While she's a highly visible supporter of the team, Karusha also plays a key role behind the scenes as one of the club's legal advisors. She's also a brand ambassador, which involves meeting and motivating young South Africans. So welcome to Sundown. Yay, thanks. It was Karusha's love for the beautiful game that first drew her attention to Sundowns, and she saw an opportunity to combine her passion for law with her love for football. You've been in the modeling industry dealing with Miss Sundowns, but as the industry says, you're not just a pretty face. What made you want to get into law? I've always had this idea that South Africa's got such a beautiful constitution and learning about it in school and learning about our history, I kind of always wanted to be a part of that. The next step for you is growing and developing young girls. Tell me a bit more about that. What I love is when I meet young women, there's not only one thing going on in their lives. They are students and they're doing something in their community. They are working and they're doing something else. And just so dynamic and so people that want to get involved. It's so inspiring. So you actually have a workshop today. I do, I'm so excited. Shall we get going? Yes. So part of taking part in beauty pageants is the fact that you actually have to be a brand ambassador. And of course, of course. these workshops help girls with that. Indeed. 
As a brand ambassador and corporate social investment project manager, Karusha is focused on the empowerment of women. And you can see that she really enjoys interacting and being a mentor. I find many people in university that are well, 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 She encourages her audience with a personal insight and experience while emphasizing the need to be self-motivated. All you need to do is hold that thought in your mind, push yourself out of your comfort zone. What you're supposed to be picturing is the how. Karusha, thank you so much. That was an amazing speech. Thank you so much. Going through your journey, you've had a lot of people that have mentored you and worked with you to get to where you are today. What advice would you give young South Africans that are on their journey? Learn, 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 learn. Have a teachable spirit. That is my advice to somebody on their journey. If you have a teachable spirit, there's nothing that can stop you. If you are there, humble, ready, willing, Every opportunity that comes your way, you'll make the best of it and another one will come along.